Hey guys, it's James, and this is a new segment I'm doing called Factor Fails. If you guys don't know, I um, get to judge uh, factor grants that come to me, and I get to read over the application and give my thoughts at a percentage of points that I think are good and hopefully that gets moved on and they get approved or not approved. All the names in all these stories have been changed, all the numbers have been slightly changed so no one can hopefully tie back but you know if you wrote it and you're hearing the story it may be about you. Okay so the first one I'm doing is called Producer. You, I got the bio and it's written on, you know those like text, like, uh, like writing apps that you get with your computer? I got that. And there's no photos, there's no links, there's no nothing. It's basically um, just like a paragraph. It's not even structured great. Anywho, so I was like, okay, whatever. Started reading it and this is basically how it went. Hello, my name is Annabelle and I was in the knee breakers and after a bit we didn't we have 1.1 thousand followers on facebook and we ended up not moving forward with the project so i broke away and i'm starting my own project so i'm working with the same producer and he's a big famous producer now at this point i googled and facebooked the name of the producer and i saw some credits and he's you know worked on some records None that I know of, none that I've heard of. I have no clue who this person is. And that's okay. I mean, there's a whole bunch of producers around the world. You know, not everyone gets to work on big projects. You know, some are great producers and they're putting out great indie records all the time. But don't say that he's a big famous producer if he's not a super big famous producer. He may be big in your town or, you know, even over there in Eastern Canada or wherever, or wherever you're from. But if you say big and famous, and I'm expecting to at least Google him and be like, oh, cool, he works with, oh, I know that band, blah, 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 blah. So I'm working with this producer and we, you know, he listened to some of my ideas and he says they're hits. He says they're amazing and we don't have any demos recorded, uh, but we we know that it's going to be a hit. The record's going to be a hit. So we're asking for $14,000 to do the record and then, you know, 500 for promotion. $14,000 for the record? Okay, so he charges like he's a big famous producer and you're hiring session musicians because he don't play or he's playing it himself or whatever. But $14,000 for a record where you don't have any demos and you have like maybe a hundred likes on your Facebook page now. You have no, so, no social media presence and you know, but it's a hit. Yeah, you're gonna have to sell me more than that. Uh, I need something tangible. I need a marketing plan. Give me like, cool, once the record's done, we're gonna go off on tour. We're gonna go do this. I'm gonna get a band. We're gonna do this. No, it was like, oh, I need $14,000 because it's a hit. No. Uh, no matter how good your producer is, uh, no. Uh, I, there was nothing, absolutely nothing I could grasp onto that was just like, oh yeah, cool. Yeah, maybe $14,000 is a reasonable number just to give you. Yeah, don't don't come to me I'm like, it's a hit. We have no idea what we're doing, but it's gonna be a hit. No, uh, that's not gonna happen. Uh, that is a factor fail in my books. And uh, I'd love to hear what your guys' thoughts are down below. Do the groundwork, work your butt off. There's so many hardworking musicians out there that deserve uh, all the grants and funding from all these great uh, sources like Factor um, and Music BC and all this kind of stuff like that, which are great. And um, I support them fully, uh, but do the groundwork, work your butt off, and you then come with a plan of attack and a reasonable number and you can probably get approved. Okay, I will catch you guys later. Hope you guys enjoy this new series, Factor Fails. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Hey, it's James from Support the Scene. If you're interested in being interviewed or want to be featured on our channel, please comment down below or find us on Facebook and message us and we'll get back to you as fast as we can. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Rock on.